Hi everyone, this is Tina from CJ Dropshipping. So today I'm going to be answering another frequently asked question, and that is, I register with CJ Dropshipping. What is next? Uh, what is the SOP? <laughs> so I created this video um, as a general roadmap uh, on how to navigate through our system and what our system is able to do and how to save you time. So without further ado, let's head over to the application. So if you go into um, CG Dropshipping and sign in, this is the interface that you will see. Um, so after you sign in, go into My CJ, and if this is your first time logging in, I would suggest you go into the authorization menu and then add your Shopify or WooCommerce store if you have one. Um, all you have to do is to enter your Shopify or WooCommerce store ID, authorize it, and follow the prompt to complete the authorization process. <coughs> after so, you will see the store status as activated here. And what this does is it enables us to pull all the products from your store uh, so you can post sourcing requests directly on our application, which looks like this. Um, so if you go to my CJ <coughs> sourcing, um, it will look like this and you can uh, click on, for example, this is you know a bracelet that you're selling on your shop. You can just click on it and then source with us because maybe we do not have this bracelet. Um, and this bracelet is only sold on your shop. So if you click on this, just hit submit. Um, this sourcing request will be in queue for our sourcing team to uh, to find, and they will uh, find vendors and factories that will provide the exact um, product uh, for you. Now, of course, you would always have to go and check back to make sure that we really did find the correct uh, product. But uh, we do have a team that is uh, expert in sourcing a lot of products for our clients. Um, so this is what you can do. And then the second thing uh, the op authorizing your store would enable you to do is that um, all the product that you connect with our application will be automatically pulled into our application. Um, all the unfulfilled orders for the products that, that you connect with our application will be pulled in here. As you can see, these are all the store all the um, order numbers from your store and um, if you just go through them and if you decide to batch submit the uh, orders with us all you have to do is to select them add to cart um, make the payment and after you make the payment our processing team will see your orders and they will go out to purchase um, all the inventory uh, for your your orders or if we already have the inventory in our warehouse, we will fulfill them the same day. Otherwise, if we have to wait for inventory from other factories, it will take two to three days. Um, in the meanwhile, though, uh, right after you make the payment and our processing team is starting to process this um, this order, tracking numbers will be generated, labels will be uh, will be generated, and these tracking numbers will automatically be populated to your Shopify or WooCommerce shop. Now. Um, if you are in the Amazon, eBay, or Wish, or any other uh, e-commerce platform, we're very sorry. Currently, we are unable to uh, connect to those platforms, but we that is our goal by the end of 2018. So do check back in um, time to time to see if we are able to connect to those other uh, e-commerce stores. Uh, but even if you are not able to um, connect to those stores, you can manually um, import the orders um, through an Excel template that we have. Um, so, just want to show you how our template looks like. Uh, all you have to do is to put in your store order number, the SKU, the quantity, um, the customer name, and the address. Um, and those are all basically all the things that, and the phone number, those are basically all the things that we ask for you to submit um, an order. They will also be populated here, and you can make the selection and make, add them to cart this way as well. Um, another really cool feature that I think our platform has is the incomplete orders feature, where it pulls all the orders um, for the products that is in, in them. But then even like, for example, this is an incomplete order because only one of the product is connected. Um, both orders need to be connected in order for it to go to the processing tab for you to just uh, select and add to cart. Um, but in this case, one of the product is not connected. So in this product page, you have the option to either make a connection if you know that we source this product for you, or you can post a sourcing request like I showed you before, and that will 
uh, enable you to complete the connection the product connection um, and all you have to do is to click here update and it will jump into the process required tab um, so imagine how much time this will save you you don't have to uh, if you are sh uh, Shopify or WooCommerce um, user all you have to do is to connect your shop you can post sourcing requests automatically you can um, fulfill orders automatically in our platform tracking numbers will automatically be populated and your customers will be notified there's a lot of legwork that our platform is able to do for you and save you time um, uh, when you use our system so um, this is you know a general system so this is how we process orders now right after you process the order if you have a dispute or um, if you you know a few days after the order your customer received the, the item and they said oh the product uh, arrived defective or the, or you know this is not the product that I order very very simple all you have to do is to go to the dropshipping center go to dropshipping orders find the order the book order or you can just type in the store order number here and search for it um, or you know if you know which book order you know this is the recent one you click on here and it will show all the sub orders inside that book order that you can put a dispute for so what kind of dispute um, selections do we have we have like for example no tracking numbers the products defective inventory various selections but just make your selection here um, and then let us know what you would like to do you would like a refund or a reset I mean, there's no no arguments, no, uh, you don't have to like struggle with communicating with a Chinese supplier uh, to, to, to make sure that they understand what you want to dispute in your orders. Um, you can attach, you have to attach a file though, like for example, if it's an effective product, make sure to ask your customers to send you a picture of the defective from, uh, product and attach it here so we can see and we can, we will no, no, notify your um, factory telling them, hey, you know, this product is not up to par. Uh, you either have to make sure that the quality you sub uh, you send to us is up to par or we're not going to be doing business with you in the future and we have to find other suppliers for our customers. So this is what you can do here. Um, and this is um, what we can do after sales. So this is an overview of what our application can do. There is plenty more, but um, in the beginning, this will, I think, uh, what I just explained to you will be sufficient um, in getting an order through us. And once you get an order through us, you will be able to experience the whole uh, process. And many, many of the customers that have not used our uh, platform and they were using AliExpress plus uh, Obler or like Dropify or some other platform, they are telling us your platform is so much easier to do and we're not getting this from our customers we're getting these from the customers VA, which handles most of the day-to-day -day tasks uh, for you know our big customers so um we we know that our platform really can save our customers a lot of time in uh in their e-commerce uh, business so we and we provide this uh application as a tool for our customers to use for free um you know, no sourcing fee, no processing fee, there's no setup fee, we don't charge a fee for you to use it. So head over to app.cjdropshipping.com and uh, check us, register and check out our application. If you have any questions, leave a comment below. Let me know what type of questions I can answer for you. Um, and if you find this video helpful, please hit like and uh, subscribe to our subscribe to our channel. We will be updating and we will be posting a lot of uh, videos uh, regarding our application to assist you um, in having a more uh, a pleasant experience in using our platform. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you have a nice day. Bye bye.